Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. What we have here, we take the log on both sides. Here we have log 4 raised to power x equals to log 40 on this side. Then, here we apply the power of log n. Well, we have log m raised to power p. This is same thing as p log m. At this here, we have x log 4 equals to log 40 from here. Then, next step here, we divide both sides by log 4. At least divide this side by log 4. Also, divide this side by log 4. Then, here, log 4 cancel each other. And we have x equals to log 40 over log then next step here also we can write 40 as 4 times 10 which implies here what we have becomes x equals to log 4 times 10 over log 4 which implies here this follows log log when we have log a times b this is same thing as log a plus log b. That is here we have x equals to log 4 plus log 10 over log 4. Then here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 4 over log 4 plus log 10 over log 4. That is, from here, we have log 4 can switch each other, one left here, which implies x equals to 1 plus log 10 over log 4. Then, next step here, also, 10 can be written as 2 times 5. This is what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 times 5 over log 4. That is, this also follows the law of logarithm, and we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 4. That is, from here, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 4 plus log 5 over log 4. Then, next step here, also 4 can be expressed as 2 times 2, same thing as 2 squared. All we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 2 squared plus log 5 over log 2 squared. Then we apply the power of log room. 2 comes here and also here. This becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 over 2 log 2 plus log 5 over 2 log 2. That is here, log 2 cancel each other. This becomes x equals to 1 plus 1 over 2, then plus, here also we can write this as 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 2. Then, Next step here, we have x equals to 1 plus 1 over 2. We can write that as 3 over 2 and plus 1 over 2 log 5 over log 2. Then, next step here, we apply change of base. When we have log a over log b, we can write this as log a to base b. And what we have becomes x equals to 3 over 2 plus 
1 over 2 log 5 base 2. Then, here we bring this together as one fraction. We have x equals to the same here as 2. And here we still have 3 and plus log 5 base 2. That is, the value of x here we have 3 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. Then, let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 3 plus log 5 base 2 over 2. Then what we have becomes 4 raised to power 3 plus log 5 base 2 over 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then Next step here, we can rewrite 4 as 2 square. Now, this here we have 2 square raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2 over 2. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then this power multiplies and 2 here comes with each other. We have 2 raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2. Is it equals to 40? On this side then here yeah, this follows when we have a raised to power n plus n which is the same thing as a raised to power n and a raised to power n then here yeah, we have 2 raised to power 3 times 2 raised to power log 5 is 2 is it equals to 40 on this side and here yeah, 2 raised to power 3 plus 8 and times this follows when we have a raised to power log b with a, which is equal to b. Then here we have 5. This is equal to 40 on this side. And here it stands 5. That's 40, which is equal to 40 from here. That is, left hand side is equal to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude here that x equals to 3 plus log 5 is 2 all over 2 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget this tip subscribe for more videos and turn the description bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments and see you next class bye for now